Hello, my name is Jerry Bant with the Avaya Serviceability Engineering Team. This video covers how to configure the Windows SNMP service on Avaya Aura Contact Center or AACC servers to forward events to one or more destinations. First, I will go over a few details regarding the configuration of the SNMP service. Then I will demo how to configure trap destinations for that service. The Windows operating system provides a simple network management protocol, or SNMP agent, that runs as a service on each AACC server. AACC can use this service to forward events or traps to a network management system, or NMS. You must be logged into the Windows Server as an administrator account to make updates to the SNMP service configuration. More details on the AACC event codes and their descriptions can be found in the AACC event codes spreadsheet. This spreadsheet is available on support.avaya.com. Now I will demo how to configure the Windows SNMP service and add a trap destination. For this demo, I am logged into a Lab AACC server with an administrator account. To begin, click on Start in the lower left corner and then select All Programs. Then click on the Administrative Tools folder. Then select Services from the list. The Services window will display. Scroll down the Services list and select SNMP Service so that it is highlighted. Now click on Action in the upper left and select Properties. The SNMP Services Properties window will display. Click on the Traps tab. If no community name is defined, then type public into the community name field. If a name was already added, you could skip this step. I will enter public into this field. As soon as I started typing, the Add to List button became active. So now you need to click the Add to List button. Then click on the Add button below the Trap Destinations section. The SNMP Service Configuration window displays. In the field on this window, type the host name or IP address of the NMS to which the AACC server should send traps. I'll enter a bogus IP address for demo purposes. Now I'll click the Add button in this window. The IP address now displays under Trap Destinations. You would repeat these steps to add additional destinations if necessary. Once you're finished, click the Apply button to make the changes. Then click OK to close the SNMP Services Properties window.
In the Services window, right-click on SNMP Service and select either Start or Restart, whichever is active. On this lab server, I am not going to restart this server as it takes a few moments and I used a bogus IP address that I don't want to configure in this server. But when you click Restart, Windows would first stop and then restart the SNMP service. After that completes, then you can close the Services window. Remember, you need to perform these steps on every AACC Windows server in your system. This concludes the demo on configuring the SNMP service on AACC Windows servers. Thank you for your time today. We welcome comments, questions, and feedback at mentor at avaya.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. For more details or related information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you for choosing Avaya.